now available in paperback and Kindle Unlimited, Isis, Escape from Transylvania. The goddess next door and John Haynes must escape a horde of vampires from a hunt in this horror-filled Isis series adventure. Get Isis, Escape from Transylvania in paperback and Kindle Unlimited today. I was watching a David Carroll video, and he was talking about the tantrum that Serena Williams threw at the U.S. Open. And when it comes down to the Afro-American Negro female who is involved with the white man that she deifies and worships, once she gets the biracial baby that she always wants, that's when she decides to show her true colors to the white man. Now, when it comes down to these Afro-American Negro females who deify and worship white men, they are often kind and pleasant to white men until they have this biracial baby with the white man, and then that's when they believe they can start showing their true colors, because the Afro-American Negro female believes once she has a child, she has leverage in the relationship, and she believes once she has this leverage, that's when she can start showing him the same nasty attitude and big mouth that she does when she's involved with this Afro-American Negro. However, what usually happens to women like Serena Williams is what happened to Halle Berry. Now, your Halle Berry decided that she would go out here and get involved with French-Canadian model Gabriel Aubrey, and as she had this relationship with Gabriel Aubrey, she had her daughter Nala, a biracial child. And after she got that child, she decided to start showing out with Gabriel Aubrey being this domineering, emasculating female. And your Gabriel Aubrey, he tolerated this just to protect his daughter. However, your Gabriel Aubrey eventually got tired of dealing with Halle Berry's outburst and her tantrums. And what he did was... He then imposed the full power of white supremacy onto Halle Berry because he eventually said enough was enough, especially after that Thanksgiving incident where Halle Berry decided to send Olivia Martinez to go fight him at, at when he was bringing his daughter home. And that's when he decided to bring the full power of white supremacy on Halle Berry because when it comes down to your Afro-American Negro females like Halle Berry and Serena Williams, they believe they have the upper hand once they get the biracial baby. However, th th what they don't understand is that America was a country created by white men for white men, and white men are going to use the court system created by them and for them to protect their rights. And that's what your Gabriel Aubrey decided to do when Halle Berry started acting ratchet with him. He went to the court system, he got his child support, and he then went to get his joint custody and protect his parental rights. And that was his rights under the court system. And he, he was trying to work with Halle Berry, but Halle Berry was acting ratchet having a nasty attitude, having a big mouth, and she thought she had the upper hand until Gabriel Aubrey decided to impose the full pop pimp hand of white supremacy on her. And when he got her into that court, and he then had the court put the pimp hand on Halle Berry, that was the end of Halle Berry, because Halle Berry could have that big mouth and nasty attitude with these Negroes in the court system, because the court system really does, is not made to protect or support the rights of black men, but that American court system is designed by white men to protect the rights of white men, especially when it comes down to the Afro-American Negro female. Now, it may not do much in the face of the white female, but it will check the black female who decides to go in court with a white man, because once Gabriel Aubrey got Halle Berry in that courtroom, then that's when we saw your Halle Berry quite humble as she paid Gabriel Aubrey child support, because when it comes down to white men, white men only marry or get involved with Negro women for a business transaction 
And they, yes, the Negro female will get the biracial baby, but they'll usually get it with a white man of a lower economic status. And because those white men know that, ch that the court system runs on economics, what they will do is then go to the courts to get a court order for their custody and their child support because when it came down to Halle Berry, Halle Berry made more than Gabriel Aubrey and child support is based on a person's income. So Gabriel Aubrey is now getting $240,000 a year at the expense of Halle Berry. And what's ha going to happen to Serena Williams is this. The man who she's involved with, this white man, makes less than Serena Williams. And with him finally realizing that at 37, Serena Williams' career is just about to be over, he's getting ready to file for divorce on Serena Williams because he probably had to deal with that nasty attitude and big mouth up to a point. But this is marriage was never about love, it was all about economics for him. So when it came down to this guy, who, yes, he owns a website, he makes millions of dollars, but he's looking at the bigger economic picture, and he's looking at the exit right now. So he's getting ready to file for divorce on Serena Williams, and once he gets that divorce, he's not only going to get half of her assets, he's also going to get spousal support, and child support because again when it comes down to white men marriage is a business and it's a business transaction they usually make at the expense of the afro-american negro female so they can build wealth with white females they'll take all the economic income and resources they get from these afro-american negro females they swirl with and then after they've gotten that money Go build a family with that white female. But you can't tell this to the Afro-American Negro woman because the Afro-American Negro woman is spellbound. She deifies and worships white men. And because she deifies and worships white men, she wants to get this biracial baby, not understanding the trap she's created for herself. Because she believes that if she gets this biracial baby, she will get leverage over this white man, get power over this white man. But what usually happens is that's when that white man then uses the power of the courts because this white man usually, again, comes from a lower economic status because when it comes down to white men, marriage is not about love as the afro-american negro woman believes marriage is a business and marriage as a business transaction for them is about extrapolating resources so when it comes down to these lower status beta males that this afro-american negro woman chooses to swirl with what they do is they pull a swerve on this afro-american negro female and get paid at her expense. And that's what usually winds up happening to this Afro-American Negro female who deifies and worships white men. They'll get in that white man's face, they'll give him that nasty attitude, but then he then takes the pimp hand of the courts and then he smacks her down, and he smacks her down by taking her economic resources because she's just completely clueless. She sits there with her strong, independent self talking about her degrees and her job, and what the white man does is he uses that to work towards his economic advantage, because the white men who have economic resources, they're not checking for Afro-American Negro women in most cases, unless they have already had their families, as Acquisi 100 has talked about, once they've got their family, then they may get involved with, it, with a black woman. But in most cases, it's all business for them and nothing personal. But the only person who winds up taking it personal is this Afro-American Negro female who deifies and worships a white man, a white man who usually has a plan to get paid at her expense. 
If you'd like to see me make more videos like this, you can donate to my Patreon by clicking the link in the description box. And if you want to try some of my SJS Direct publications, you may do so by clicking the link to Amazon.com. That's all I have to say for this video. You can comment, rate, and subscribe.